హలో మై నేమ్ ఇస్ బి సంతోష్ కుమార్ అసిస్టెంట్ ప్రొఫెసర్ ఇన్స్టిట్యూట్ ఆఫ్ ఏరోనాటికల్ ఇంజనీరింగ్ మై సబ్జెక్ట్ ఈస్ ఇమేజ్ ప్రాసెసింగ్ టుడే ఐఎమ్ డిస్కసింగ్ అబౌట్ డెఫినేషన్స్ అండ్ టర్మినాలజీ ఆన్ ఇమేజ్ రిస్టోరేషన్ అండ్ ఫిల్టరింగ్ సో వాట్ ఈస్ ఇమేజ్ రిస్టోరేషన్ వాట్ ఈస్ మెంట్ బై ఇమేజ్ రిస్టోరేషన్ సో రిస్టోరేషన్ అటెంప్ట్స్ టు రీకన్స్ట్రక్ట్ ఆర్ రీకవర్ అన్ ఇమేజ్ that has been degraded by using a clear knowledge of the degrading phenomena restoration attempts to reconstruct or recover an image that has been degraded by using a prior knowledge of the degradation phenomena so restoration techniques are oriented towards modeling the degradation and applying the inverse process in order to recover the original image so what is image restoration what is meant by restoration it is nothing but it attempts or to reconstruct or recover an image that has been degraded by using a clear knowledge of the degrading phenomena and restoration attempts to reconstruct or recover an image that has been degraded by using prior knowledge of the degradation phenomena and it is a technique to oriented towards modeling the degradation and applying the inverse process in order to recover the original image suppose i am taking image enhancement in the image enhancement so what is a process means reducing the noise reduce noise so this reducing the noise is nothing but we are using filter so after reducing the noise what is called we are restoring with original image that is the image restoration so what are after reducing the noises after reducing the noises what is the final image is there that is restored suppose f of x is there f dash of x equal to there so this f of x equal to input f dash of x equal to output so this output is restoring in this image okay the f the final f dash of x final removing uh, removed image is restored with f of x that is the restoration of the image and uh, another uh, definition for image restoration is uh, to reconstruct or recover reconstruct or recover an image that has been degraded by a degradation phenomena as an image enhancement the ultimate goal of restoration technique is to improve an image in some predefined sense and the enha- and it is a enhancement technique to restoration technique can be performed in the spatial domain and the frequency domain for example noise removal is applicable using spatial domain filter whereas blurring is performed using frequency domain suppose noise removal is applicable in spatial domain blurring is in the frequency domain okay suppose i am taking suppose i am taking image enhancement this enhancement techniques are two types spatial domain another one is a frequency domain so this spatial domain is used for removal of removal of noise here using but removal of blurry so in the image enhancement spatial domain and frequency domain are two types are there uh, first one is a removal of noise and the second one is a removal of blurring okay so when we are going for the removal of noise and removal of blurring okay for these are the process of in the process of image enhancement okay so after image enhancement after image enhancement the output with noiseless this output is called image restoration so for this image enhancement that is a input image that is f of x comma y output image is a uh, f dash of x comma y okay 
So this f dash of x comma y is a replace f dash of x comma y is replacing with f of x comma y. So we are replacing or restore with original image. Replace or restore with original image that is called image restoration that is f dash of x comma y equal to f of x comma y. So it is a reconstructing or recovering the image that has been degraded by the degradation phenomena. So image degradation is a process of restoration. Degradation is a process for restoration and the complete process is called the enhancement. Image enhancement is nothing but a input to output or noise to noiseless or blurring to blur, unblurred image that is called enhancement. And the ultimate goal of restoration technique is to improve an image in some predefined sense. And we are like enhancement technique to restoration technique can be performed in spatial domain and frequency domain. Spatial domain and frequency domain. Already we discussed here. Spatial domain and frequency domain. Both are belongs to energy enhancement and these are using for image restoration. These are using for image restoration. So, uh, for example, I am taking uh, spatial domain is using for uh, removing of noise. Frequency domain is using for uh, deblurring or removing the blurring of the original image. That is a frequency domain filtering. Okay. How a degradation process is modeled? Degradation process is nothing but what is a degradation process? Degradation process is nothing but a, it is the process of image restoration. Degradation is nothing but a restoration process. How a degradation process is modeled? Image degradation is a process that act as an input image f of x comma y through a degradation function h and an additive noise mu of x comma y. It results in a degraded image g of x comma y such that g of x comma y equal to h of x comma y into f of x comma y plus mu of x comma y. Okay, so g of x comma y is a degraded output. Okay, so it is a process that acts of an input image f of x comma y. Input is f of x comma y. Degradation function h that is a it is a degradation function. So the output g of x comma y output is a degraded output h of x comma y is a degradation process so degradation process to the input image degradation process to the input image why i am doing it means for the removal of noise so in the original image is noise is occurred so original image noise is occurred. What do we have to do? I am using degradation process. Why I am using degradation process? To remove the noise. Okay. So degraded output. Output is a degraded output equal to original image with degradation degradation input original noise original input with noise i, I was removed the noise i was removed the noise in the original image okay so noise is removed how a noise removes means degradation process is applied degradation process applied to the original image for removing the noise that is the output of degraded output so g of x comma y equal to h of x comma y into f of x comma y plus mu of x comma y it is a degradation process of equation where h of x comma y is the spatial representation of the degradation function and the symbol star indicates the convolution. Here h of x comma y is the degradation function. 
h of x one is the spatial representation of the degradation function, and the symbol star indicates the convolution. So note that we only have the degraded image g of x comma y. The objective of restoration is to obtain an estimation of the original image. So we have to estimate as a close as possible to the original input image. And in general, more we know about h and nu. So nu is nothing but a noise. H is nothing but a degraded output. f of x comma is the input function. So input function with the noise is there. So degraded degradation function is added to this one for the removing of noise. That is a g of x comma. That is a degraded output. So degraded output equal to input uh, a, a degradation process with input image with noise. That is a degradation or restoration process. Here one example. It is f of x comma y. That is the input image or original image. Degradation function is a h. Here why I am doing h means the noise is occurred. Noise is occurred here. So g of x comma y is a degraded degraded output. Okay, degraded output is the input for the restoration filter. It is a f dash of x comma y. So finally, f of x comma y equal to f dash x comma y. Why? Because this output is restored with the original image. Okay, that is a restoration process. Okay, first off is the degradation. Second off is the restoration. So degradation is nothing but when the noise is occurred. Restoration means after removing noise. Noise added, noise removed. So when the noise is added, that is a degradation process is occurred. When the removing the noise, remove the noise is nothing but a restoration. So it is the image restoration and degradation model. So what is meant by <coughs> unconstrained restoration? The noise and or new a meaningful criteria function is to seek an f. That is a input function such that h f h f is a output approximating of the least square sense of assuming the noise term is as small as possible, and it is known as a least square error approach. Define a differentiation as sharpening is the process perform differentiation on the pixel to sharpen the image. And what is the image differentiation? Image differentiation is the Enhanced process for edges discontinuities and de-emphasizes in the pixels with slow varying gray levels. Okay, the question is that what is meant by unconstrained restoration? The noise and a meaningful criteria function is to seek an f such that h approximate of least square sense by assuming the noise term is as small as possible. It also known as least square error approach. Okay. When the noise is small amount of noise is occurred in the image, that is a least square or unconstrained restoration. Define differentiation. Yes, sharpening is a process perform differentiation of the pixels to the sharpen of the image. So, what is the use of sharpening? Smoothing the sharpening means remove blurrings. So sharpening is nothing but then we are removing the blurrings of the original image. As sharpening is a process, perform differentiation on the pixels to sharpen the image. So what is image differentiation? Image differentiation enhances the edges, discontinuities, and de-emphasizes the pixels with slow varying gray levels. That is called the image differentiation. What are the three methods of estimating the degradation function? So we are estimating the degradation. Estimation means for noise removal. We are estimating the removing of noise. Observation, experimentation, mathematical model. Observation means noise level. Experimentation means.
mathematical model means so what are the three methods of estimating degradation function so there are three types of estimating degradation function observation experimentation and mathematical modeling observation means uh, what is the noise how much noise is occurred what are the levels of noises in the virtual image experimentation means uh, we are applying the mask or filter technique uh, depends on noise i will be using the filter technique and uh, mathematical modeling means uh, transformation technique mathematical modeling means we are using transformation technique we are using transformation techniques to removing the noises from the original image that is a method mathematical point another thing is a converting uh, image of one form to the another form that is a mathematical modeling so what are the types of image degradation degradation comes in many forms such as motion blurring noise and the camera is focus these are the image degradation process so image degradation nothing but noise levels or occurrence of noise so degradation comes in many forms such as motion blurring noise and camera is focus in many cases like motion blurring is possible to come with very good estimation of the actual blurring function and undo the blurring restoration the virtual image most cases motion blurring is the happen in the technically that the motion blurring is also a noise but it is comes with good estimation of the actual blurring function of the undo the blurring restoration of the original image image restoration methods what are the image restoration so degradation is nothing but a noise levels or occurrence of noise noise is occurred so what we have to do so restoration means uh, after uh, removing the noise so after remove the noise so image restoration is nothing but after removing the noise uh, we are replacing with the original image so there are various methods available for image restoration such as inverse filtering vnr filtering constant least square filtering blind deconvolution method etc some of the methods are either linear or non linear methods helps to remove noise and blurring of the image so there are various methods are available in the image restoration to removing the noises that is a inverse filtering vnr filtering constant least square filtering blind deconvolution method so these are the image restoration methods to removing the noise and replace with original and uh, finally the other methods are there that is a linear and non linear so this linear and non linear helps to remove the noise that is the input image okay that is a image restoration methods image restoration is the process of recovering the original image by removing noise and blurring of the image image blur is difficult to avoid in many situations like photography or to remove motion blurring caused by camera and uh, shaking radar imaging to remove the effect of image system response etc so image restoration is the process of recovering the original image okay suppose original image is f of x comma output is f dash x comma y so original image is recovered with the output so this original image is removing the noises or blurring so it is a 
noiseless so this noiseless or on blood image is the output image that is a dash of x common it is replaced with the original image and uh, image blurring is difficult to avoid in many situations like photography or to remove motion blurring caused by camera shaking radar image or to remove the effect of image system response etc and uh, noises and its characteristics what are the noise and its characteristics so noise in digital image arises during acquisition and transmission so noise levels are two acquisition and transmission so noise in digital images arises during first one acquisition that is the environmental condition that is light level sensor capture and type of camera so it is nothing but is completely physical device physical device problem in our language that is a camera but in the image processing the camera is nothing but the sensors okay environmental condition means uh, some environment is not supporting uh, depends on our light focus or sensor capturing or blurring of the camera or uh, object is moving if object is moving also uh, technically one problem with uh, physical device and uh, transmission means uh, interference in the transmission channel to remove noise we need to understand the spatial characteristics of noise and its frequency characteristics that is a fourier spectrum okay so transmission is nothing but interference in the transmission channel Inter in, uh, interference means the, the noise is occurred between the input to output so interference noise is occurred that is the interference of the transmission channel and to, re to remove the noise we need to understand the spatial characteristics of noise and its frequency characteristics of uh, fourier spectrum so generally spatial noise is assumed to be independent of position in an image and uncorrelated to the image itself that is there is no correlation between pixel values and the values of noise components mm -hmm. frequency properties refers to the frequency content of noise in the fourier sensor so generally spatial noises so spatial noises are two types linear and non-linear if any of the filter is linear that is linear uh, otherwise it is a non-linear but spatial noise is assumed to be independent of position in an image and uncorrelated to the image itself that is there is no correlation between pixel values and the values of noise components the frequency properties refers to the frequency content of noise in the Fourier sense so what are the noise models Spatial noise is described by the statistical behavior of gray level values in the noise component of the degraded image. Noise can be modeled as a random variable with a specific probability distribution function (PDF). Okay, so depends on your noise model, then to find suitable filter. noise so in the noise model to find out type of noise so in the noise model first we have to find out the type of noise if we know the which type of noise is occurred then we have to easily uh, finding out the which type of filter is suitable to remove the noise so finally what happened means uh, to remove the noise is a final output thing so what are the noise models are? there are so many types of noises are there depends on your image there are so many types of noises are there and uh, 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 types of noises means noise level how much noise level is there suppose low level of noise or high level of noise what is the level of noise depending on your level of noise we have to use the type of filter so spatial noise is described by the statistical behavior of the gray level values in the noise component of the degraded image and the noise can be re, uh, remodeled as a random variable 
with a specific probability distribution function. Specific probability distribution function that is a PDF. So parameters of the noise model define the spatial characteristic of noise and uh, whether the noise is correlated with the image and uh, frequency properties refers to the frequency content of noise in the Fourier sense. When the Fourier spectrum of noise is co constant, the noise usually is called the white noise. So parameters to find the level of noise. So, what are the parameters to find out the level of the noise? Okay, parameters of the define the spatial characteristics of noise and whether the noise is correlated with the image. And the frequency properties refers to the frequency content of noise in Fourier sense. And the Fourier spectrum of noise is constant. The noise usually is called the white noise. And what are the noise models are there? There are uh, so many types of noise models, uh, depends on the noise level. Noise tells unwanted information in digital images. So, unwanted information that is a noise model in a digital image and the noise produces undesirable effect such as artifact, unrealistic edges, unseen lines, corners, blurring objects and the disturbances of background scenes that is a. So, there are so many types of noises are there. You know, depends on your noise level, uh, we have to find out the noise model. So, uh, unwanted information is also a noise that is a digital image. And the noise produces undesirable effect that is an artifact, artistic work factor, and unrealistic edges, okay, and the unseen lines, corners, blurring of the images, and uh, disturbances of background scenes. Uh, those are also called noise models. And to reduce these undesirable effects, peer learning of noise models is essential for further processing. To reduce these undesired effects, prior learning of noise models is essential for the processing. Okay, so what are the typical noise models are there? Uniform noise, Gaussian noise, salt and pepper noise, gamma noise, relic distribution noise. Okay, there are so many types of noises are there. So typical noise models are uniform noise, Gaussian noise, salt and pepper noise, gamma noise, and relic distribution. So these are the noise models are there. So depends on noise levels dividing as a type of noise. So depends on your noise levels, we are finding uh, dividing as a type of noise. Okay, there are two, so many types of noise models are there. Uniform noise, Gaussian noise, salt and pepper noise, gamma noise, and relic distribution. So, what are the examples of noise models? Gaussian noise, relic noise, and gamma noise, exponential noise, uniform noise, salt and pepper noise. So, these are the major types of So these are the major types of noise models, Gaussian noise, relic noise, gamma noise, exponential noise, uniform noise, impulse or salt and pepper noise. These are the some major noise models included in the image process. And uh, spatial filtering can be done when only additive noise is present. The following techniques can be used to, to reduce the noise effect. So already we discussed this, there are so many types of filters are there, depending on your type of noise, we have to use a filter, okay. Uh, suppose I have taken one type of filter. So, for which purpose, which type of noise we are using that for type of filter, okay. So, spatial filter can be done when only additive noise is present. Spatial filtering is done when the additive noise. So, uh, we have to clear about this one. Additive noise. For the additive noise, I am using spatial filter. So, like this. Which type of noise, which type of filter, that is important. Mean filter, for which purpose I am using mean filter, that is a mean filter means, in the in the mean filter there are so many types are there, first one is a arithmetic mean filter, it is the simplest mean filter, let x, s, x, y represents 
the set of coordinates in the sub image of size m into n centered at point x comma y the arithmetic mean filter computes the average value of the corrected image g of x comma y in the area defined by s x y so g of x comma y is a corrected image so what i have to do f of x comma y into nu of x comma y means noise with image that is a corrected output so uh, we have to apply the filter for this one okay so arithmetic mean filter is a simplest mean filter to representing the uh, coordinates of the sub image of m into n pixels of x comma y coordinates and uh, arithmetic filter computes the average value of the corrected image g of x comma y in the area defined by s x y the value of the restored image f at any point x comma y is the arithmetic mean uh, computed and a linear spatial invariant degradation system with additive noise can be modeled in spatial domain as the convolution of the degradation point spectrum is the is the functionality of an image it is followed by the addition of the noise or equivalently in frequency domain the product of the fourier transform of the image and the degradation followed by the addition of ft of the noise addition of ft of the noise solution is available for linear in a uh, in linear spatially invariant degradation model <coughs> it is the image of figure a figure b it is a degradation estimation by impulse characteristics first one is a an impulse light first one is a impulse and second one is a image of a degraded impulse so an impulse light shown in impulse function with the light and it is a degraded impulse means uh, some blurring will be happened why because here i am applying the mask applying the mask or filtering to remove unnecessary things okay it is one example of uh, degradation function of impulse or light with degraded impulse function and uh, these are about linear positions and it is a image degradation and noise g of x comma y is a degradation function h of x comma y plus mu of x comma y h of x comma y is a degradation with noise okay noise is occurred or not yes noise is there it is a noise that is a degraded so what we have to use we have to apply the filter to remove the noise so g of x comma y is telling the noise level how much noise is level is there that is g of x comma y h of x comma y is a degradation process with noise okay that is a degradation process so it is about the linear position invariant system so today we discussed what is meant by image restoration so it is attempts to reconstruct or recover of image that has been degraded by a degradation phenomena and it is the image enhancement uh, that ultimate goal of restoration technique is to improve an image in some Or techniques that can be performed in the spatial domain or frequency domain. For example, I have to remove in the noise that is a spatial domain is suitable. I have to remove in the blurring of the image that is a frequency domain filtering is suitable. So, how degradation process modeled? Image degradation process that acts in input image f of x comma y through the degradation function h and anti noise is u. So here degraded output, degraded output is nothing but a degradation function input function nu it is a degradation function it is a degraded function that is a nu is a level of noise so image degradation is a process of act of in input image f of x comma y through a degradation function h and the additive noise nu the result of degraded image g of x comma y here h of x comma y is a spatial representation of the degradation function and the symbol star indicates a convolution and note that we only have the degraded image g of x comma y and the objective of restoration is to obtain an estimate of the original image and we have to estimating of close possibility of the original input image in general the more we know about h and nu the closer will be f of x comma y it is a degradation function h restoration function for the f dash of x comma y so restored output is a f of x comma y degradation function is a 
f of x comma by the h. So g of x comma by equal to this function h of x comma by into f of x comma by plus mu of x comma by. Okay. So it is about the noisy. If noiseless means that is a restoration filter f dash of x comma by. If f dash of x comma by is nothing but a noiseless. Noiseless is a degraded or restore restore restored output. And how to unconstrained the restoration? What is meant by unconstrained restoration? The noise n is a meaningful criteria function such that f such that h approximating is a linear square since, and assuming the noise term as small as possible, it is known as a least square error approach. Define the differentiation. What is the differentiation? As sharpening is a process of performing differentiation on the pixel to sharpen the image. And what is the image differentiation? Differentiation is nothing but a sharpening the process perform the differentiation of the pixel to sharpen the image. And image differentiation is nothing but a image differentiation enhances the edges and discontinuities and deemphasizes the pixel with slow varying gray levels. What are the three methods of estimating the degradation function? Observation, experimentation, and mathematical modeling. These are the three methods of estimating. Observation means uh, we are observing what the how much noise levels are there. Experimental means uh, applying the mask or filtering technique. Uh, mathematical modeling means we are converting from uh, one form of uh, in, uh, to the another form. F of x comma y to g of x comma y, g of x comma y to f dash x comma y. Shall we call these are the mathematical model? Yes, transformation methods are applied. Okay, and types of image degradation. Degradation comes in many forms, such as monitor, motion blurring, noise, and camera of focus. And uh, motion blurring is come up with very good estimation of the actual blurring function of uh, blurring the restoring of the image after blurring or restoring. Image restoration means various methods are available in the image restoration. That is inverse filter, VNR filter, constant least square filtering, and blind deconvolution methods are the types of uh, image restoration filters. And uh, these are the major two types of filterings are there: linear and non-linear filterings are there. To removing the noises and uh, blurring of the image. Image restoration is the process of recovering the original image by removing the noise and blurring from image. And the blurring is a difficult to avoid in many situations like photography to remove motion blurring caused by camera shake, radar image, mm -hmm. and the removing of the effect of image system from the physical device. From the physical device, uh, when the noise is occurred, it is difficult to remove. Noise and its characteristics. There are two types of uh, characteristics: acquisition and uh, transmission. Acquisition is nothing but an environment condition that is a light level and a sensor captured. And uh, transmission is nothing but an interference transmission channel to remove noise. We need to understand the spatial characteristics of noise in frequency pair characteristics. Acquisition means majorly it is a physical device problem. Physical device problem. Transmission means uh, uh, when the transmission to receiver noise occurred. Okay, and uh, generally spatial noise is assumed to be independent of position in an image and uncorrelated to the image itself. That is, there is no correlation between pixel values and the values of noise components. Frequency properties refers to the frequency content of the noise in the Fourier sensor. What are the noise models are there? So, depends on the noise level, we have to use the noise models. Spatial noise is described with the statistical behavior of the gray level values in the noise component of the degraded image. And the noise can be modeled as a random variable with a specific probability distribution, that is a PDF. And uh, what are the parameters to finding out the noise models? Means spatial characteristics of noise and whether the noise is correlated with the image. Frequency properties, nothing but uh, refers to the each frequency content of noise of the Fourier sensor. When the Fourier spectrum of noise constant, the noise usually is called the white noise. 
and what are the noise models are means unwanted information in the digital image is also a one type of noise and uh, artifact unrealistic edges unseen lines corners blurring of the image background scene blurring disturbances are also a noise and uh, reduce these undesirable effects of prior learning of noise models in essence for further proceed okay and there are noise models are there uniform noise gaussian noise solid pepper noise gamma noise relic distribution noise these are the noise models what are the major examples of noise models are gaussian noise relic noise gamma noise exponential noise uniform noise uh, salt and pepper noise depends on type of noise so we have to using the type of filter to remove the noise that is a image restoration okay thank you like share and subscribe hit the bell icon for more updates